Welcome to Dearborn Surgery Center. We're glad that you're here. This is one of our rooms that you'll come to for pre and post-op for your surgery. Education begins at admission. So we'll be bringing your support person back with you to the pre and post-op room. Once you've been dressed, we'll start by taking your vital signs. This is a sequential device that will go on your leg to prevent blood clots during surgery. Once in the operating room, the hose will be connected to a pump that will massage your legs. Next, you'll be signing your consents. Your consents are for anesthesia. The procedure itself where we clarify that we are doing the proper procedure on the proper person. Your nurse will be starting an IV. It is very important that you have an access during your surgery. You'll be receiving your antibiotics through that IV, as well as any pain medication or sedation that you may need. Before you go back for surgery, you'll be speaking with your anesthesiologist, as well as your surgeon to answer any questions. After your surgery, you'll be brought back to the pre post op room. The surgeon will talk to your support person in the waiting room. There may be a wait until they're brought back to the post-op room. During this time, we're getting you comfortable, letting you rest, and waiting for you to feel up to having family. Our first post-op goal is to assess and manage your pain. Once we've achieved that goal, we'll be sitting you up and offering you something to eat and drink. It's very important that you let us know if you're having any nausea. This is something that we can treat with a variety of different medications. Once you're tolerating food, depending on your procedure, physical therapy may be coming to see you. It is normal to have tiredness after anesthesia. It is our goal to get you home, resting and relaxing in your own environment. This is very important. Once we have achieved all of your discharge goals, we will be sending you home with your support person. Here are a few important things you can do to help your recovery. Ankle pumps and walking are ways to help prevent blood clots postoperatively. If you come out of surgery with a dressing on, that dressing will stay on for two to three days, depending on your doctor's preference. You'll be given a refillable, resealable ice pack to use postoperatively. Ice is important to help prevent swelling as well as treat pain. It's important that you elevate the leg properly. Take your pillow, long ways, under the knee, all the way to the length of the heel to elevate above the level of the heart. If you have a small amount of drainage from under your dressing, you can simply take a bandage and reinforce it simply by putting it over the top of the dressing there and taping it. This bandage and this tape can be found at your local pharmacy. You'll be receiving a post-op call from us. We like to call all of our patients and check and see how they're doing. We'll be also asking you if we could have done anything to make your stay better. From all of us at Dearborn Surgery, thank you for trusting us with your care. Good luck with your surgery and good luck postoperatively.